Trouble. Yeah, you're no trouble, trouble, and I avoid trouble. No, because you say you're going to be leaving me in like what, two years, a year and a half? Leaving you? Yeah. You're not leaving the show, American Idol. You're attached? leaving me. Yeah. Okay. Wow, I didn't know. You, you know, know we're dating. Oh, no, you're dumping me. <laughs> I like the fact that the two of you are dating. Yeah, we, we, have a we make a good. Right? We do. Yeah, we do. I can feel something. Are we a good couple? I can yes. feel something. Yeah. Simon, you're single now, right? Are you? <clears throat> Seriously. Uh, is that true? <laughs> Are you really single? Sorry. Yeah. Why? <laughs> you did not just ask me that question. Well, well no, that's, that's a compliment. Question. Why are you single? Because you're I cute. haven't found the right man. That right means, here, that live means TV, Simon Cowell. This right is a man. public hookup, right? Yeah. yeah. You've said that you pretty much Adam is the one you want to win. If he doesn't, how disappointed are you going to be? Oh, look, you know what? When you do this show, you have to accept that, you know, America votes. They're entitled to, to vote for whoever they want. I would look. I'm not going to be crying tonight if Chris <laughs> wins. And by the way, I wouldn't be surprised if he wins tonight right. because I think as a person, you rooted more for him last night than you did for Adam. Yeah. Yeah. There was something sort of puppy doggish about him that made you, know, you that think... last song, he was so nervous. It just, you know, your heart went out for him. You know I'm what I mean? climbing the mountain to swim in the fountain. Of the whatever. ocean, of the sea, thank of the you, land, of the lost. Well, I'll be seeing you, you later. You can cry in my shoulder if you want later. <laughs> <laughs> so you know better than anybody what is going on in the minds of Adam and, and Chris. What is it? Uh, if they're smart, they're just trying to find a place to take a nap. I think um, I remember this being the most just grueling week schedule-wise. And, and um, you know, it's it's. I, I think for both of them, I, don't, I, I not to demean tonight, but I just don't. They're both such great guys as well as great performers. I just I think they both have amazing things ahead of them and. I think whoever wins, uh, they both won. And you're singing a song tonight that's obviously very close to your heart. Yes. Tell me about that. Uh, we're going to perform Permanent from the record. Um, it's a song that, uh, that I actually wrote about my brother Adam. And um, the, we're going to put the live performance up on iTunes. All the proceeds are going to go to ABC Squared, an organization that helps raise money for brain cancer funding and awareness. And uh, yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm really excited to be able to do it, to be able to do it on this stage and, and uh, to do it in a manner where hopefully we can, we can be a small part of finding a cure. And, of course, last year your brother was such a big part of the show just by what was going on with him and the, and the time he came to the audience. So this kind of makes sense for you to do this here today. Yeah, I think um, you know, one of the last times uh, my brother saw me perform was actually a year ago at the finale. So um, just, uh, I'm, I'm just excited to, you know, to be back. And, and um, you know, today's about Adam and Chris and, and, and the work that they put in this season. And I'm, I'm really just excited to not be the newbie anymore. Yeah. I mean, let's be honest. That is nice. <laughs> And are you handling this all well? You're processing it? I mean, obviously, it's very tough to lose a sibling. Absolutely. But I think for me, um, you know, for my family, it's just a matter of uh, you, the show must go on. So we're going to keep plugging forward and, and, and try to do what we can to uh, make sure it doesn't happen to anybody else. So have you t had time to process it and think about what you feel is going to happen tonight? You know what? I think of the finale finale as the most celebratory time. And it, it's, it's something that... Nobody misses. I mean, it's an event um, full of surprises and, like, poignant memories and goofy things and great performances and huge stars. And I said it to you last night. Again, this could be your last time on this red carpet if you don't come back. Are you threatening me? <laughs> Are you threatening me? I'm just trying to see if it feels bittersweet, knowing in your mind that could be it. Uh, I have to make that decision, and... I'm going to think carefully about it, but, you know, I've been in this business for 20 years. I don't think I'll ever get tired of walking the red carpet, you know? It's always fun. It's always exciting to see everybody. So talk about the song today. It was sort of not so na not so positive about the song. Yeah, what were, I, don't, I didn't yeah, listen to people, it. Yeah, a lot of people were not loving the song, though. You hadn't heard any of that talk? No, I didn't hear it. Yeah. But now I'm hearing it. You know, it's they learned it quickly and yeah. You know, it's a winter song. It's supposed to be inspirational and hopefully they'll buy the downloads yeah. and hear the recorded versions. You gotta sing a song like about it. mountains. You can't sing it about fish, right? Yeah. <laughs>